Hot 97, the infamous radio station where an anything goes philosophy reigns and chaos is normal, has a well-earned reputation for their controversial and over-the-top antics. I previously reported on this radio station with a well-known violent past where I talked about a few of the things that they've been doing in detail over the years. Now, if someone isn't getting beat up by a DJ, shot outside of the station, and no one is participating in in an on-the-air slap fest where people slap each other across the face for money, then it's a good day at hell. I, I mean, at Hot 97. And with that said, their best and brightest, a master of the art of interviewing, Angela Martinez, the Puerto Rican goddess, quit her job at the radio station. On Wednesday, June 18th of 2014, Angie had this to say about her departure. Quote, Today I resigned from Hot 97. I am grateful to the Emmis family for my time with the company and the immeasurable way that it has shaped my life. We made history together in so many ways and I will cherish those memories and my friendships forever. This was one of the toughest decisions I've ever had to make, but ultimately, it is time to move on, to grow and to be challenged in new ways. Saying goodbye is always emotional and bittersweet, but I am extremely excited about the future. Thank you, Hot 97, and most importantly, the listeners, for an unimaginable journey. Today will be my last show. Stay tuned. Love, Angie. End quote. Now, my initial reaction to the news after my jaw dropped <laughs> was that I am happy for her. Why? Because she's doing what she wants to do. She's doing what makes her feel good. Now, I personally want Angie to be on the radio forever. But hey, if she wants to put her headphones down on the table and cut her mic off, more power to her. I just hope that Power 105 FM or some internet company or satellite satellite company will make her an offer that she can't refuse. Her decision to resign left me feeling some type of way because I'm a celebrity in the making and I plan to not do interviews in my professional career for numerous reasons. However, my plan was that if I ever did change my mind and decide to do an interview, it would probably have been with Angie Martinez. This is actually something that I think about from time to time. I think about how it would be an honor to be grilled by her, by one of the best to ever do it. Angela is the voice of New York without a doubt. I grew up listening to her along with Jazzy Joyce and Coco Chanel on their ladies night shows. In fact, truth be told, Angie Martinez is one of the people that inspired me to be a great interviewer. So thank you Angela for your contributions to radio for so many years. You're a legend. And I hope that someday I'll be able to interview you. How about that? I mean, I can always fantasize, can I? It's not like she's ever going to see this video. So what do you think about Angie's decision to walk away from Hot 97? Is this the end of the station? I think that is good news for her and worse, the worst news that the station could ever get. Now, their star player is leaving the game. So they better bring back Star and Buck Wild to take over the mornings if they ever have a crumb of a chance against that crazy Power 105 DJ Charlemagne the God. That man is a riot. He's freaking hilarious. Let me know what you think below and be sure to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Meat Magazine on YouTube. The website is meatmagazine.blogspot.com.